Hi everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be going over the single, the fourth single from um, X and Y called The Hardest Part, which, yeah, it's, yeah, it only has two songs, which, underwhelming, but it's okay. I, this is the last one that has two, this is the last, no, the talk was the last b set that had two songs, so, yeah. Um, how I usually do these single EP and album reviews is I go over all the tracks, all the music videos, which in this case is only one. Rank all of them and then get my thoughts of the rating at the end. So it is that simple, and this is a short one. So it's this video is gonna be short and sweet. So and no one has patience nowadays. So I, that that's why I try to keep things shorter. If you want longer, then I don't know how to do that. So number one was the the hardest part. This is the first song. This is the title. This is the title track. Or I think I don't know. It is. But like I don't know how to. I didn't know how to word it. So this song is a breakup. It, it sounds like a mid eighties kind of love breakup song mid 80s breakup rock song i think that is what i think it is pretty nice pretty nice tune i really like it it's in my top 20 i'm gonna give it a five out of five it, it, like i really loved it at first like at first listen i loved it i love that song so yeah um i really haven't heard much of this song live like the only versions they played live i think were the piano version so i don't know but i bet it sounds cool live so i don't know Next up was How You See the World, number two. Live from, I think, Earl's Court. And, yeah, this song is freaking crazy. Like, at, it, it, at its own studio version, it sounds sick. It sounds amazing. I love it so much. And the live version just makes it a lot better. It This guitar in the, in the studio version, it's really good, but it sounds like it's kind of, like, on the twang, twang a little bit. Um, the one in the live version, it's absolutely, like, rock solid it was it's really good it's really good from rose court um both how you see the how you see the world versions are awesome this one is another five out of five in my opinion so yeah <laughs> so moving on to the music videos category and this is and there's only one so yeah there's always one in every ep or single or <laughs> yeah um but yeah, this is the hardest part music video. It's really, really good. I mean, I did not expect it to be. Like, some people told me, like, it was cringe, and I watched it, like, a few months ago, and I, I don't know what I thought of it. I just watched it yesterday for my review. And it's really good. The, 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 skill, the skill shown between these two dancers is crazy. So, it starts off. Um, one guy is, I already forgot his name. One guy's like 20 some, the other one's 84. Uh, they're going to be showcasing their dance moves and Coldplay's playing the hardest part in the background and they're just shocking everybody with how much talent and skill they have with their dancing. I, I like it too. Like it was insane. Like it, I had my mind blown while I was watching it, but yeah, that was pretty cool. I'm going to give the hardest part music video a 4.3 out of 5. So if I had to rank these, how you see the world live, it's gonna go, it's gonna, it's the best song on this, so, and the hardest part will go second. Both songs are 5 out of 5, so, it's, really that, so the whole thing, the whole single, this is the first one ever that I'm gonna give the full thing a 5 out of 5. All the songs and everything were just 5 out of 5 clean, like that. Uh, awesome job by Coldplay, which is pretty cool. Love it. Like it, love it, I want more of it. Thank you all for watching my short-ass review, but <laughs> have a just good day, I guess.